YouTube. It's me. Try, try. I have not made a YouTube video in quite some time. Like, talk to you. I don't have a lot of followers, so <clears throat> starting something new. This video is going to be about surgery, weight loss surgery. It's going to be about the vertical <clears throat> gastric bypass sleeve. I think I said it correctly. Um, and my desire to get it, my frustrations, my fears, and yeah. Um, a little bit about me. I have struggled with yo-yo dieting and struggled with my weight for quite some time. Um, I've had periods where I'm loving the skin that I'm in, all of it, and I've had periods where I don't even want to look at here down. Um, I don't let my weight define me, but at this stage in my life, I'm ready to make a lifestyle change, but I'm impatient. I want it now. Unfortunately, I don't have the funds for it to just up and do it. Um, <clears throat> so with that being said, I decided to take the first initial step and go and see a surgeon <clears throat> um, and find out my options, find out if I qualify, find out a little bit more besides watching YouTube videos um, about the actual surgery itself and how it will help me in changing my lifestyle and making those healthy um necessary lifestyle changes um it is not just going to be about weight it's going to be about changing me from the inside out number one i'm a smoker don't judge me i know <clears throat> that's that I thought I would be able to continue, but clearly after watching many videos and doing a lot of Google searches and joining forums, that is not a go. And I'm okay with that. I'm going to be 33. I don't look 33. Mm. <laughs> but I'm going to be 33 next year. And I've been smoking since I was 21. So it is about time. I don't even like smoking anymore. So it's definitely time that I put the cigs down and pick up a positive and a healthy habit rather than continuing a bad one. So I'm okay with that. Um, <clears throat> my fear, my absolute fear is that the insurance company is going to come for me like King Koopa in his castle, shunning down on Mario and Luigi. <laughs> um, I, um, <clears throat> I currently don't have insurance through my job. I do have um, Medi-Cal. Um, and I know that there's a lot of requirements um, for the surgery in general, but I know that for... Um, for this particular insurance, there's definitely a lot more that I have to do. Um, I have gone and I have been going to a weight loss clinic. Um, it's not like Weight Watchers or anything like that. Um, but it's kind of like a, a Atkins program type thing. So high, pro high protein, low carbs. Um, <clears throat> but I'm just, all of that's recorded weight loss, weight gain, weight loss, weight gain. I'm scared that um, I'm going to have to start all over. One second. Sorry about that, my children. Mm, they don't know when to leave. You say bye, they keep coming. Anyway, um, yeah, so there's a lot of um, things that I feel 
with the insurance company that I'm going to have to go through hurdles and all kinds of stuff. But I'm just praying that, you know, I'm going to keep close to God with this. And I believe that this is something that I need. I know my dad, he, he is diabetic and I'm scared shitless. Keep it 100 with you. I'm scared that, you know, <clears throat> I could fall into that category. And, you know, I definitely don't want to do that. So, <clears throat> um, anticipation. Watching these YouTube videos, mm, all these beautiful women before and after, I'm like excited. Like, I'm not a bad eater. Like, you see the thickness. <clears throat> I'm thick. You see this? Yes. But I'm not a bad eater. <clears throat> I'm really not. I know how to eat healthy. Um, I cook very healthy meals, you know. But the thing is, is that I have a busy schedule. I'm literally like tray of all trades. I do everything. Um, so I really don't have the time to sit and really prep like I should. I should make time, but I just, I don't. Um, <clears throat> but what was I saying? Um, I'm, I'm just, I'm not a bad eater. I just need to be consistent. Um, so that's not really necessarily my worries. Um, what else? I watch these videos and I, I get excited and I see myself thin. <clears throat> um, to to have the, the body that matches the face. I love my face. I love everything. This is no makeup. This is raw. You're getting it raw. Chap lips and all. <laughs> um, but, you know, I want to match my body with my face. I want to be healthy. I want to run and not walk at the gym. I want to have energy. Not just energy to work, energy to, you know, um, do hair, because I do hair, um, and I bake cupcakes. So not just energy to make money, because I know I have to do it, um, energy to go out with my kids, go to the park, and I get tired, or feel too lazy to get up and push it off, um, get out and meet different people. And that's probably one of the main things, main reasons. <clears throat> I'm not saying that I'm insecure by no means. Um, but I hinder myself. Um, I'm not thin enough for that person. That's, that's what I think. And that's not a good way to, to view yourself or to view others to automatically assume that you just do not qualify <clears throat> and that's what I have found myself doing and it sucks I've been single for three and a half years because all the while I'm saying I know my worth and I'm not gonna waste my time anymore the fact of the matter is is that I don't think I qualify yet you know and that's an unfortunate feeling to have. But anyway, I digress. Um, I want this surgery. At first, I wanted lipo. Then I wanted a tummy tuck, mommy makeover. Then I wanted a Brazilian butt lift. But that's not going to change my weight, nor is it going to change my eating habits or my lifestyle. That's just going to change me for the time being. And I'm not going to be satisfied. So this is going to be a journey. A long journey, whether it be six months, a year for the process, I pray that I don't get denied. I do have good luck. <laughs> I do. So I pray that I'm just that person that just gets qualified and has a smooth transition into greatness. Um, I pray that I don't give up. I don't get discouraged, in which I know I will, but I pray that I don't get that discouraged to where I just give up and say, you know what, it's okay. I'll try something else. I no longer want to be a yo-yo dieter. I want to live and be happier in my skin. So this is going to be the journey. I know you guys have seen a lot of journeys like a month prior to the operation, this is going to be the pre-pre-op journey. 
that's what I'm looking for. I, I want to film the entire process prior to the ups, the downs, the, the highs, the lows, the joys, the pain, the tears, the laughter. I want to start that because as I'm filming this, I'm low-key getting teary-eyed. I wasn't going to film that. <laughs> um, I, I just, I'm going to start anew. Walk a day, a week, a month, a year in my shoes to see the process and how and if this process is successful. <clears throat> I don't have a lot of viewers because I'm not on YouTube like that. Um, hopefully, I can start to get some viewers and start to get some <clears throat> some feedback um, from others who have gone through the process. Um, maybe people who have yet to start the process. Hopefully, this can be insightful for you. Um, I just want to be great. Or. Uh. Everything's going to have an er. Fabulous er. <laughs> um, great er. Better. <laughs> I just want, I want to live in my truth. Stand in my truth. Understand that I am beautiful with or without this surgery. But Lord, if this surgery comes my way, I just want it, I want it to be documented. I, I want it to be a um like a time capsule type situation where I can look back and view this very video and see that I looked happy but look at me now so again my name is Trey 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 call me Trey Trey this is me and this is my new journey thanks for watching Subscribe, friends. I need friends. Subscribe. <laughs> All right.